You've pointed out that historically, when relationships between Beijing and Washington go south, China tends to turn to Japan. Do you think, given all, all of these geopolitical concerns remain in the South and East China Seas, they'll be able to overcome that to find some common ground to work towards? Well, those uh, issues are very difficult to overcome, but uh, they are manageable. Uh, so, in the short run, I think this year and at least next year, uh, Japan-China relations uh, is going to be in a very good shape. Is that going to potentially help on the trade front for, for both Japan and China, given some of the issues that they're dealing with with Washington at the moment? Uh, yes, it's a positive factor for sure, but whether it can really offset the, the damage that it may get um, by uh, the policies that's coming out of Washington, we have to wait and see. You talk historically about some of these deep-seated issues that are very difficult to get past, right? We've seen in the past, you know, Beijing really kind of mobilise popular sentiment and popular nationalism uh, to, you know, boycott Japanese trade. We've seen that with regard to Korean businesses as well. Do you see that as being something that is potentially still a possibility, given, the, you know, there's a level of unpopularity when it comes to uh, China-Japan relations in China? Mm -hmm. Yes, um, the Chinese Communist Party always has this uh, history card uh, against Japan in their pockets. So uh, uh, that situation is going to continue. So whenever they feel the need to take it out, uh, I'm sure they will do that. Professor, who needs each other more, Japan or China? Uh, well, it depends on the situation. Um, Japan has always uh, tried to mend its relations with uh, China. Um, you know, it's quite clear that it's to the national interest of Japan to have a good and positive relationship with China. But China has its domestic uh, issues, so whenever they need uh, this Japan card, uh, they will uh, take it out, it may, uh, the history card, the territory card. Um, so in this case, uh, China needs Japan uh, more, I would say, at this point of time.